Shelly here, we are going to talk about our core. So sometimes the core gets confused with just our six pack muscles, right? That's your rectus abdominis. We are going to be working all of our abdominal muscles today. So our transverse abdominis, we're going to focus in on those obliques and we're going to work on that six pack muscle, your rectus abdominis. So I know after having five kids, one thing that I really wanted to do was to strengthen my core again. So these moves are going to help any of you that have had a baby or trying to come back from having kids, right? Um, a couple of options I wanted to give you because maybe a plank is not where you're at yet. So a perfect option is to come to a wall or if you have a rail or even a dance bar, which I happen to have today, and do your planks against that wall or against that bar. So anything that I'm doing on the floor, just go ahead and repeat those movements standing up. And then when you feel ready, bring it down to the floor. Another option here too, if you have any sort of wrist issues, is gonna be to come down to forearms. So just really listen to your body, make it work for you, and I want you to think of drawing your belly button in. So imagine a vacuum, it's gonna suck your belly button in towards your spine, kind of like a belt cinching around your waist. Try to hold that feeling, that's your transverse, it's supporting and getting stronger. And when that is strong, we're gonna do everything better. You guys ready to get going? All right, I'm gonna start down in a plank. So right here on those forearms, Option on your knees. So if you want a little more challenge, I want you to rock it forward and back. I'm gonna rock. Now I'm gonna pike it. I'm gonna jump. Three, two, one, back. Here we go. A little hop. Good, jump, jump. Tailbone high. Give me two more. Bring the knees in, knee, knee, right here. If you need to, come to the knees, take a break, come back into it when you're ready. Keep it going, nice and strong. Shoulders are over your wrists, hips are staying low. You guys open it up, side plank, right here. Add a little hip dip and up. Option on your knee and lift. Keep it going, up, press. We're really working into those obliques. I'm gonna take it down, roll it onto your back. Little sit up, crunch. Good, abs are in, lift. Making sure your elbows stay out and that you could fit your fist right between your chin and your chest. Take those legs tabletop, bike, bike. Now quick, quick, quick. Give me slow, slow. Speed it up, slow. Find that little twist, keep it going, slow. You guys, we're gonna stay here for a little bit longer. Woo! Feeling my abs slow. Keep it going. Come on, up. Keeping the head and the chest lifted. Good. All right, we're gonna repeat all of that on the other side. Bump it up to your plank. Hips are low, get yourself stacked up. When you're ready, start to add that little rock for me. Abs are in, keep it going. Nice and strong. Rock it. Remember that option to come to your knees or maybe even your forearms, okay? All right, you guys, we have that little pike coming up. Hips are gonna go to the ceiling. Hop it in three times. Here we go. Three, two, one. Up. Jump it back. Good. We're getting the core and the shoulders. Jump, jump. One more, take those knees, drive it in, keep it going, up, up, oh, feeling it, nice and strong right here, give me four, three, two, side plank, we're going to open it up, find your balance here, okay, lift up on that bottom side, add those hip dips, hip down, lift it, it's small, it's effective, Good. Bring it down to the floor. Roll it on your back. Hands behind your head. Find that little crunch. Lift and lower. I want you to focus on keeping that low back against the floor. Lift it. Take those legs up. Single. Speed it up. Slow, slow. Quick, quick, quick. Nice, you guys. Keep it going. Speed it up. You're almost there, up, up. Slow, slow, find that little twist. Slow, 
Keep it going. Last one, twist it. Woo! Nice job, you guys. Hopefully you're feeling those abs. <laughs>